gold coins, and a selfish man. Sam was a greedy and selfish man. He always desired to have lots and lots of money and never hesitated to cheat others to make money. Also, he never wished to share anything with others. He paid very low wages to his servants. However, one day, he learned a lesson that changed his life forever. It so happened that one day, a small bag that belonged to Sam was missing. The bag had fifty gold coins in it. Sam searched high and low for the bag but could not find it. Sam's friends and neighbors also joined in the search, but all their efforts were in vain. After a couple of days, the ten-year-old daughter of a man working for Sam found the bag. She told her father about it. Her father identified the bag as the one that was missing and immediately decided to take it to his master. He gave the bag back to his master Sam and asked him to check whether the bag had fifty gold coins. Sam was exultant to get the coins back, but he decided to play a trick. He shouted at his worker, There were seventy-five gold coins in this bag, but you gave me only fifty. Where are the other coins? You have stolen them. The worker was shocked to hear this and pleaded his innocence. Selfish and greedy, Sam did not accept the worker's story and decided to take the issue to court. The judge heard both the sides. He questioned the daughter and the worker about the number of coins they had found in the bag and they assured it was only fifty. He cross-examined Sam and Sam replied, Yes my lord, I had seventy-five gold coins in my bag and they gave me only fifty. Hence, it is quite obvious that they have stolen twenty-five coins. The judge then asked, Are you sure that your bag had seventy-five coins? Sam nodded vigorously. The judge then made his judgment. Since Sam lost a bag of seventy-five gold coins and the bag found by the girl had only fifty coins, it is obvious that the bag that was found does not belong to Sam. It was lost by someone else. If anyone finds a bag of seventy-five gold coins, I will declare that it belongs to Sam. As there are no complaints about the loss of fifty coins, I order the girl and his father to take those fifty coins as a token of appreciation for their honesty. Moral Honesty will always be rewarded and greed punished.